Hey everyone, let's explore the bricks and pieces in the Safari Wildlife Treehouse by Lego Creator. This is set number 31116 and it contains 397 pieces. Now just by looking at the box, looks like we get ourselves a giraffe and a treehouse that's on a stump and we get a pink flamingo and we also have two alternative builds. So it looks like we can build some kind of a boat and an airplane. Now honestly just looking at this, this set doesn't look too thrilling, but I'm interested in seeing what the parts look like. So let's head over to the Lego table and let's see what's inside this box. So it looks like we just press these two things in and just push this down kind of crude. <laughs> so Lego made this to where these boxes are not recyclable. Pull all that out. And so far, just by looking at this, it doesn't look too bad. All right. Well, since I'm a mock builder, I don't really like to follow instructions. So do I really care about three instruction manuals? I don't think so. I don't care about those. This is what I'm interested in right here. Now let's blast through this really quick. Start with this bag here. Oh, well, we got bags within bags. That's even more exciting. Let's just throw the bags on the ground. And I'm really surprised Lego still uses uh, polyurethane bags the way the environment is now. This is kind of a waste. A waste of plastic. Just goes into a landfill, although I do recycle, but some of the stuff cannot be recycled. Anyways, so it looks like we obviously get some of these. I believe these are 1 by 10 plates with bow and we get a few of these so these are pretty good for making like campers or roofs or something like that oh wow is this like light aqua one by six brick how many of those do we get in or just one that's not good put that over there for an anchor for the camera so we also get some olive green we got some of these half round four by eight plates and a 2x16 in olive green. It's pretty cool. Of course, we got your usual door frames and windows and some of these pillars. Uh, looks like we got ourselves a 2x4x2 half round wall element. And looks like these are dark brown arches as well. So you actually get a bunch of these 2x16s. Anything else in here? Oh, we got some minifigures. Double-sided head. Anything else in here that's exciting? Now, the reason why I'm opening this setup because there's a few pieces that I need out of this for a few mocks. So I'm just throwing up and getting through these now. I'm trying to look for anything else. Oh, you, you get a bunch of these uh, one by one headlight bricks in bright orange. Anything else in worth mentioning? No. Some jumper plates, slopes. Actually, that's a that's like a brick with arch or a plate with arch. One by one by two thirds. Uh, I don't see anything else that's really worth mentioning in here. I'm just blasting through this real quick. I may miss stuff. Most people don't watch these anyways. It's a benefit to them as well as myself, so I know exactly what's in here. All right, let's open this one up. And yeah, I mean, I get questions asked, where do I get all my parts from? And I just shake my head. I'm like, you're asking that on a mock channel, where I show you where I get the parts from. So we obviously get some 1x3 roof slopes and some child minifig legs. This is the green-blue color. Don't have those in that color. It's a pretty nice treat to have. And so we got ourselves a wig. It's like we got ourselves a ponytail. I almost said Ponita. That's the wrong thing on this channel. And I got a Palisade brick and 1x3 plate. Some of these in, what are these, 1x2 plates with a horizontal holder. These are in dark orange. A wine glass, some glass parts. And here's a piece that I was planning on ordering in a, in a previous order. I never did. This is a Fro wig. This is in black. I kind of wish I could find that in another color, especially red. But that'll work pretty good for what, it, what the set has. 
so far I'm not really seeing anything that's really standing out to me yet. Just the usual stuff that you'd find in a creator set. Let's open this little bag up here. Lately, LEGO has been uh, lacking in creator sets. This is a reason why I stopped buying sets in general. Because it's just not a lot of bricks anymore. It's just mostly oddball parts. Well, speaking of oddball, we get a couple of hot dogs that are in sand green. So if you really want, you can make some moldy hot dogs and put them in your mock. So what are we getting there? Like four of those? Oh, you got a bunch. There's like five of those in there? Yeah, that's pretty good for making moldy dogs, huh? So, uh, we've got some tooth pieces. These make great for curtains. And first time for me, heart pieces. It looks like you get a few of these. Look, what have we got in here? Three of these? I don't have any heart tiles. So that's what they look like. Pretty cool. I don't have any hearts. I may end up getting some in a later haul. And some slopes and one by one by one by one downwards angular plates. I do need these one by one slopes for a build. I just need a handful of them. I just placed an order for those. Uh, so, well, I got them in here. <laughs> Give you four of them, so that's cool. I only needed two. And some studs. Matter of fact, these studs are in uh, olive green. And my apologies, guess what, guys and gals? It is early in the morning again. So this is the only time I can film these it is bright and early. Because guess what? Yours truly has work. Well, by the time you watch this, this is on a Saturday. But when I film these, it's like i got to get some excitement before I have to do work for 10 hours. So obviously you get a 1x4x6 uh, by by bright orange door torso and some leaf pieces. You don't get a whole lot of leaf pieces for this being a tree house. This is all you get. Just four. So not enough to make my forest or a campground. <laughs> it's a start. And more palisade bricks. You get one by two, one by four palisade bricks. And slopes and other various pieces and such. Here's a topper piece. Looks like a hat. Forgot to mention this. It's a one by one. In fact, that looks pretty good. Uh, that would make a great little lampshade if it wasn't in black. Of course, you got some of these printed eye pieces too. That's probably for the giraffe. And a couple of these uh, minifigure accessories where they just put these in the hands like this. And of course, you can just attach stuff to the back side of those. So, all in all, you know, just by looking at all this, is there enough parts in here to make a mock? Just from the set, no. <laughs> you know, especially one of my mocks. I mean, this is kind of really. This is just plates. I very, I don't see a whole lot of bricks. This is all I see. Very few slopes. Oh, these are worth mentioning right here. Is these two by two by two thirds play with bow. These would make great backs of a sofa or a, a dining booth. But other than that, though, this set really doesn't have a lot of stuff. It's just not really appealing to me uh, as a mock builder. It does have some parts, but really most of the stuff I have literally hundreds of. But, uh, yeah, there's not much else to say about this. If you're interested in the review, I'll have a link in the description for the complete review of this. I'm only going to do a review of the, first, of the main build. I'm not going to do the whole thing. So, yeah, there, there is some unique colors for parts for some pieces, but honestly for me, this is mostly just a hodgepodge uh, lot of parts for the set.